What's going on guys, Amazing Watts here back with another video guys and today guys I'm going to be showing you guys a strategy you can use for Final Boss Gother. Um, so what you, what you, what you want to do guys is you want to run Red Hauser, Blue King, Blue Lilia and then a Red Arthur in the back. So this team is actually a very um, different team. You wouldn't really see a team like this but um, we've seen a lot of the, the Asian players on, on that side of the game. They're, they're using the the red hauser strategy and how it works is you want to be uh saving hauser's cards for the second phase where you need an aoe card and you want to just focus as many attack cards as you can though first phase to to get the go through down so i'm gonna do these two single target kings here and then the aoe pierce and we have a alt reduction card which is really good so we're definitely gonna use that So we're gonna do the the cleanse because he's gonna do an attack disable yep and then we're gonna do this uh super cyclone and then the the aoe alt reduction and we also get a, a lilia cleanse also which is really good and you want to make sure guys you don't kill the guys on the side um they're a little they're a little fragile in the first phase so try not to kill them like as much as you can like um, that's really good. We got another alt reduction, which is really good. If he doesn't attack disable, we'll use this card right here. Yep, so he's gonna lower any Hauser cards, but there isn't any to lower, so we're good. Yep, so we don't need to use that heal actually. We can do this one. I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna do this. So we can get some lifesteal here. So I actually use lifesteal food, guys, just to make sure that whenever I attack with Hauser, I basically full heal. So um you want to make sure you're doing at least um hp food or lifesteal food because either of those foods are really good for this um fight guys so here we go so since he did the attack disable i think i'm gonna go for the heal and what we're gonna do i think we're just gonna eat the alt to be honest because we can't really attack here we can, it's just the problem is, since he has the taunt up and these guys are really low, I can't really do like much. So I'm just going to have to move some cards and get king alt. So I'm going to do this and do the attack. It's going to attack the, the guy on the side, but it's all good. We don't need, um, we don't need to do AOE cards on the first phase, so we're good. But um, yeah, so he's going to do his alt, I think. And we still have a cleanse card too, so if he does do an attack disable, yep, so he does it on Hauser. So it's all right, we're gonna, we're just gonna wait till he does his thing. We're gonna do this ult, and then we're gonna do this ult. Yep, so we're gonna do this, then this. This should kill, it should kill. Um, yeah, this, this should definitely kill here. We're definitely killing here. And we got the rank downs with that uh, Lilia ult, which is really good, guys. All right, we're going into the next phase pretty strong. Um, as long as you guys keep uh, doing your purifies when you when they're needed and you keep drawing them cards, you're going to be getting like a really high score, guys. Um, like, I've seen the range for this is about 2,500 to about 4,000 at the highest. Um, there's a YouTuber, uh, Sekapoko, he got a 4,150 and he was number one for about an hour, so it's pretty insane, so shout out to Sekapoko, yeah. So here we go. Do a decent chunk of damage there, and then we're going to have that Hauser alt to reduce his, um, to reduce his alt gauge also, because he's going to have a level two card for sure. And we're going to use this cleanse also just to clear off the buffs. Here we go. Do this, do this. And then we're going to do... I think we're going to do the pierce card. Yep. So look at all that, guys. We got a ton of buffs right there. Or a ton of points, I should say. And we're going to life seal all that back. Hauser should be almost full HP, which is really good. And we that's a really good uh, card draw right there. We got the heal and the cleanse so that's a really good card draw so there we go 
so we're gonna do this right here we're gonna do a heal and then we're gonna do the alt reduction so double heal um i only did that just to connect the the alt reduction card and also we kind of needed the heals so yep definitely worth let me get that off there we go alt reduce that's a ton of points and then we're gonna do this also and it's gonna lower the uh go through alt gauge also and we have another cleanse card too so we're, we're in a pretty good situation guys right here so i'm gonna do this card right here just so i can get this cleanse off and then do my alt so he's not yeah we're not gonna be attacking the boss there but it's all good because this cleanse is gonna give us a ton of points and then we're gonna get the alt off and do a decent amount of damage and and lower his uh alt there we go pretty good Okay, we got another level 2 Lilia, which is really good. Um, I think what I'm going to do, actually, is move this Lilia card over here, do the, the cleanse, the cleanse heal, and uh, get a level 3 off. That's a pretty optimal, uh, optimal move right there. So, get a ton of points with the cleanse. And then we're going to do the, the alt gauge reduction card, and we're going to get a ton of points here. That's a ton of points, guys. And then we have another alt on Lilia. So we're just chaining these alts, guys. You just gotta keep chaining these and getting these cleanse card draws. And you're gonna get a really good amount of points in the end. So we're actually doing really good here. Um, we're getting a really lucky with our card draws. I'm not gonna lie. This is a really good run, actually. Um, yep, we'll get the cleanse off. We'll do the alt and then we'll do this Hauser card. Decent amount of points right there. We're going to lower his alt again. Yep. There we go. Decent chunk of damage. And then king alt should kill this next turn. I'm going to make sure to use a cleanse and a heal card. Just to get a little extra points in. Um, actually, just to be safe. I'm going to do just the cleanse card. This card and this card right here. That should kill. So this should be a really good run, guys. This should be, yeah, definite. This is a definite good run right here. At least 3,000 or higher. Um, we'll have to see. Yeah, so 3,500, guys. This is like a really solid run. If you get a run like this, guys, you, you can easily get like top, top like 1%. Um, right now, my highest right now is about 3,700 and I'm in the top 0.27%. Um, last time I checked, I'm probably, yeah, so 0.2% uh, in the rankings, or 2.8 now. But uh, yeah, guys, so I'll just go over the team real quick so you guys know what's what's going on. Yeah, because the video I dropped yesterday, it's a little outdated now, and it's, or, it's, it's only been a day. So this team right here is the one you want to be using. Um, so it's this team right here. So you have Red Hauser um just drop your best attack gear on him and then i put attack gear on king and put hp gear on a lilia you could definitely swap it between the two but it doesn't really matter with these two you just want the cleanse and the heal and then we have the arthur in the back for the health related stats on hauser and lilia so all right guys so i hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to like comment subscribe as always guys and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out guys